Now we're going to look at the pro hop. So the pro hop, Hubert's going to be my defender. He's going to be on the night head. He's going to be on the night head. And I'm coming full speed. This time I'm going to take a second dribble. So I'm going to take one dribble. Hubert comes across. I take another dribble. And then I use that second dribble to bring my body across the lane, land with wide feet like a cat, bring it across my belt line, and shoot. So let's take a look now. Wes will do it. Two dribbles. Okay, bring it across your face. Teaching point. Teaching point that Sam did a really good job of. Many players will bring the ball across their belt line. We want them to bring it across their face much stronger with our elbows on the ball. Let's take a look. Good. For a baby jump shot. Land with wide feet, Mike. Wide feet. Good. Nice. Good. And there's two ways, hold up. There's two ways to work on the pro hop. One way is the one, two, come sideways. I've created space, I've landed wide, baby jump shot. Another one is if the, if the big man comes a little further out, is to pro hop by them and finish. Let's pro hop by Hubert. Oh, we want to get by him though this time. We want to get by him. Okay, again, by your face, by your face. Good. Nice. Wes, try to get it by your face. Okay, so again, now all of a sudden, we're really tough to guard because we have the layup, we have the Euro step, we have the floater, we have the pro hop. So we're finding ourselves to be a, a finisher that can finish in a variety of ways and keep that defense off balance. So that's gonna be called the pro hop. Next finish we're gonna do is the inside hand finish. So Hubert's gonna trail me. Now we have to have an imagination. Guys, am I short? Yes, they like to tell me that, okay? So the idea being is this, Hubert, how tall are you? 6'2". 6'2", we're gonna imagine Hubert 6'3". Again, my advantage is quickness. So let's count my steps. If, I, if Hubert's trailing me and eventually he comes in, he can block my shot because he can time it. My disadvantage. My advantage though is to be quicker. Hubert, stay, stay put for now. So if I take my normal steps, one, two, three, four, I'm getting to the basket. Now, let's take another count. If I go one, two, three, and shoot an inside hand finish, I've shortened my steps by one, and that allows me to be quicker, advantage to the smaller player. So you see Kyrie Irvin do this a lot. One of the big things that we wanna to try to do is we're gonna come in, we're gonna jump outside the block, and we're gonna jump off our outside foot and extend the inside hand. Common mistake that we see is players will come in and they'll scoop the ball, which takes away an advantage, that's slower. So the teaching point is outside the block, ball at the face, extend the hand at the last second. Hubert, stay put, but let's watch Brendan, inside hand finish. Very good, inside hand finish. Good. Use your length.